Hey everyone, today I want to talk to you about something that we seldom talk about, bad days. Hey, thanks for watching. I am Greg Taylor, uh, founder of Marketing Press, and today I want to talk about, you know, one of the things that we rarely talk about, you know, in the entrepreneurial or the startup world or anything like that. Let's talk about bad days. You know, a, a long time ago when I first started uh, Marketing Press, close to six years ago now, my good friend Susan Beyer of Audience Audit told me, just fight the good fight. And I've always really held that close to me. You know, not every day is going to be a great day in business. You know, you're going to have rough days. You're going to have days when clients are demanding and you can't deliver what you want to deliver to them or you can't get enough done or you lose a client or uh, a project isn't as profitable or maybe you're struggling with some work-life balance, you know, and things at home aren't, you know, aren't going, you know, perfectly, you know, to help you, you know, have a clear mind to go into the office and stuff. So you are going to have bad days and it's okay because if you just continue to fight the good fight and to keep putting your best foot forward, they're, they're going to go away. You know, uh, I can really honestly count the number of bad days that I've had in six years of marketing press in, you know, on my two hands here, you know, on, on my 10 fingers. So the things that I do when things, when I'm having a rough day, and I like to say rough day versus bad day, are, you know, I, I really think about how thankful I am and how grateful I am for a situation that I've created, you know, for my family and, you know, with my friends and with my colleagues and with the great clients that I work with, you know, and uh, maybe I'll write that down or I'll put it on a post-it note so that I can look at it. Or, you know, some people even put it in like, a jar, you know, so that they can go back and reflect on it. Other things I try to do is I try to get out of the situation. You know, I try to work to create solutions. And sometimes the solution is removing myself. Like uh, I actually had a rough day today and I went for a, a run, you know, around 430 here in the mountain of in Phoenix. And, you know, I came back and I sort of reset and refreshed. So those are a couple things you can do. The other thing is just acknowledge them. You know, talk to people that you trust, talk to people, you know, have somebody you can confide in, have a best friend, have a, you know, a partner or uh, a wife, spouse, girlfriend, something like that, that you can talk to and say, you know, today was a rough day. You know, it's okay. It doesn't mean your business is going bad. It just means that you're human. So I definitely encourage you to keep talking about, you know, not only the good in your business and what you want to do, but also the more difficult times. So Thank you for watching. I would love if you left a comment on your favorite social network sharing this video and telling us how you cope with your bad days. And also, if you'd like to subscribe to our YouTube channel, you can go to gregtaylor.net slash YouTube. Thanks for watching. We'll see you soon.